Welcome everyone. Context empowered visual attention prediction in pedestrian scenarios. While people have addressed free viewing saliency prediction a lot, the important case of pedestrian attention prediction is not explored yet. In contrast to free viewing saliency prediction, the pedestrian scenarios presents unique challenge as listed here. We record the first publicly available dataset for pedestrian attention prediction. The dataset consists of diverse street crossing scenarios based on the German in-depth accident study report with the different street layouts. To further increase the realism, we embedded these scenarios into a virtual reconstruction or a digital twin, where we mainly manipulate two context factors in navigation tasks that are highly relevant for pedestrian scenarios. Moreover, the provided visualization of context-based eye gaze distribution are in line with the empirical studies, where subjects tend to look further away in the case of in-hurry unsafe setup to look for more potential hazards like approaching vehicles. Our architecture introduces a concatenation layer between encoder and decoder that introduces context information. Ground truth saliency maps in pedestrian attention prediction are much more sparse, only containing few no zero entries. To account for this, we extend the mean square error loss by exponentially weighting it with the magnitude of the prediction, which penalizes high prediction less. To address the interactive nature of the environment challenge, we for the first time propose to model uncertainty in a human attention prediction model. We report epistemic uncertainty in line with literature, where the dropout variational inference is adopted during the inference phase. In line with prior works, we adopt common evaluation metrics, which are listed here. Table baseline shows the evaluation results against the latest publicly available state-of-the-art approaches. Um, published on MIT um, Benchmark, where our results outperforms baseline in five out of seven common metrics. The results of our ablation study are summarized in ablation tab table, where the uh, latest or the proposed setup outperforms other setups in four out of seven metrics. While general saliency prediction is not the focus of this paper, we evaluate a context-free version of our model given silicon challenge, where our model outperforms the other methods by a significant margin in the case of Pearson correlation coefficient metrics. We randomly select positive and, and negative um, cases constrained by the performance of our model. A little of analysis in deep case too strongly relies on the center bias priors, leading to an overestimation of the extent of the attention focus. Unisal shows more accurate prediction. Sal FP net models um, show comparable to Unisal results, but includes more false positive prediction whereas our model is able to produce prediction close to the ground truth without relying heavily on the center bias or producing false positive predictions. We introduced Context CellNet, a novel context-driven visual attention generation approach for street crossing pedestrian scenarios conditioned by the sparsity nature of the fixations in street crossing tasks, where in order to account for enormous state space and thus the lack of the data, we account for epistemic uncertainty. Context CellNet outperforms state-of-the-art um, saliency prediction models and ablation experiments demonstrate our method's ability to effectively exploit task and context factor. The publicly available data set, including additional information gathered while recording, can be used by the community